Hello everyone, this is John from JB. If you are following my um, my video for yesterday, so uh, I did purchase for the Magni, which is uh, 4,800 unit at the price 208. So its total sum up value is 10,031 ringgit and 45 cents, including the uh, brokerage cost, growing fee stamp duty, and the service tax as well. How do we get this figure for the Magni? So, okay, I'm going to show you how to calculate the contract notes for this trade. So, I'll go to the uh, KLSE Screener apps. This one is the KLSE Screener apps. Huh? So, there's uh, one feature, so it's a uh, bookish fee calculators. Fee calculators. So, what I need to do is uh, I key in the quantity, the price. The price that I purchased for many is 2.08 and the quantity, minimum quantity in Busa Malaysia is uh, 100 unit. So, I purchased 4,800 which is 48 lot. So, um, I need to click cal calculate. So, total figure is 10,041.44. It doesn't tally to the figure uh, which is 10,031 ringgit plus. So, what happened? It is because certain of the stocks under small and mid cap has been waived for the stamp duty. So, stamp duty will be around 0.1%. Every 1 ringgit, they'll be uh, charging 1, uh, every 1,000 value, they'll be charging 1 ringgit. So, if your share value is 1,001, they will be rounding up to 2 ringgit. So, in this case, make me is under um, stamp duty waiver at this moment. So, I put it 0 right over here. I click calculate again. So, I get a correct figure for the contracts notes. 10,031 ringgit 44 cents. So, total contract I need to pay for this value. This one is the standard um, contract account with a uh, bookerage minimum 12 and 0.42% uh, which come with uh, credit limits for uh, investors. So, um, this one is the most common um, account in the industry at this moment. Uh. So, um, we go for detail, we click details. So, it will be uh, segregate out all the fees at the bottom. Bookerage 341, current fee 3, stamp duty 0, stamp duty, uh, service tax 2.5. So, total value I need to pay is uh, 10031 and 44. So, that's how it works using the KLSC screener bookerage fee calculator. So um, I go back to the map and trade apps. So this one is the um, the contract. So over here you can notice the out outstanding balance uh, is uh, the due date. Due date is third of June, which is um, on Wednesday. So the on Wednesday there will be deduct the fund actual fund from your account in Maybank. So um, okay, this one is the contracts. I'll go to the details on the left button. So this one is the detail. The total hold your do, your holding total net worth is twenty thousand three, and uh, stock value is ten point two seven k, and uh, cash is ten point zero three k. So the formula for the total net worth would, would be somewhere around at uh, the stock plus cash, you will get the total net worth. So um the fund I have is ten thousand plus, uh yesterday. After I purchased the Smegni, so today I have a total net worth of 20,000. Am I double up my return overnight? No. It's a no. Eh? So, please be note that. So, whenever you're purchasing any share, the settlement is on the third days. The third market days. So, as per just now I showed you, uh, there will be settlement on 3rd of June. So, the cash will be minus off on 3rd of June by uh, 10,030 plus. So, the total net worth will back to original so it will come to the stock value so i hope you get it um so uh, i believe um the, the maybank is also also working on the total network for for easier uh, study for the clients so but uh this one total network may, might be a bit of not uh, really updated at this moment i would say so we go for the um um stock portfolio so this one is stock portfolio at this moment. So you can see the day gain. The day gain is comparing current price for the uh, my portfolio. Um, is whether up or down comparing to yesterday. Comparing to yesterday. Eh? So today Magni is up. So you can see at the bottom. Eh? Magni is 2.14. It's 2.14 last price. Eh? So which means that I'm uh, on a pebble gain around 288 ringgit gross. So... Um, I'm in the profit for 2% plus. Lah. It's minus of uh, maybe 1% around there. So net will be uh, lesser a bit. 
So um, since my target price is around two thirty and to two forty, so I need to wait for what for my trade to fulfill, or uh, if it come down to one point eight five or eight seven something like that, I might have to cut loss from there. So um, in this scenario, I hope that you understand how to read the Maybank trade apps more uh, conveniently. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you very much. Bye bye.